Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're having a good one today. I'm the Metal Junkie, and today I'm checking out Man of War's song, The Crown and the Ring, Lament of the Kings. Uh, this is the fifth track off their album, Kings of Metal. I'm going through the entire album, guys, so make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any songs. Never heard the song before. We got the lyrics. Let's jump in. church organs So this is obviously another song about going to battle um, with all like the church organs and stuff. Uh, I And it says Knights Templar right on the screen here. Uh, maybe the songs about the Templar Knights back in the day, how they were going into some uh, the crusade and stuff like that. Perhaps. I'm not too sure. I might be uh, too early on that one. But uh, yeah, the, the synths here behind um, Eric's voice. It just really elevates it, I find. Really elevates his voice. It, it, it's awesome so far. Let's keep her going. <laughs> so did they kill the king? Heroes await me, my enemies ride fast. Knowing not this ride their last. <laughs> enemies last. It's interesting to have like a crowd sing this section here. It really makes you feel like you're hearing them sing in, in this old city or this old kingdom. You know what I mean? It really adds to the, the element of the song. Um, I'm hoping we get some guitars in that in here. Um, the highlight is definitely the vocalist, Eric Adams. He's really showing what he can do and he's very poetic in his uh, lyricism. But I want to hear the rest of the band come in too. Um, you know, it's just basically like church choirs and synths and stuff so far. They're proud of it. Kingdom 
those notes. So uh, he said he's dying, he must be dying in battle. And he said, Odin, I'm coming to see you or whatever. So maybe these are Vikings. Sounds more into that vein than to be like Catholics or whatever. It seems to be like the, the Norse gods or whatever. Pretty cool. Like I said, uh, not the biggest fan of the the choir sound and that, but the vocals are outstanding. The way he can do those notes, I'm always impressed by him. The Crown and the Ring, Lament of the Kings, certainly had a certain epicness to it, you know, especially with everybody chanting together. But if I'm being perfectly honest, which I always am, uh, not my favorite track. My least favorite track on the album so far, but that's okay uh, because we still get great vocals on here, top notch. I, I wouldn't ask for anything better. And um, great poetry as well with the lyrics. I love how he, he uh, just ties in the battlefield and like how they're winning and stealing the crown from the king after they kill him and slay him and you know they bring it back to their kingdom and it really paints a picture for you uh, but the music itself just wasn't satisfying enough for me personally but that's okay because there's 10 tracks on this album and this is only one of them so let me know what you guys think of this track do you love it do you hate it are you in the middle kind of like me and uh, up next, we got Kingdom Come. And until next time, guys, thanks for watching.